Hi guys, so today I'm going to share with you what's on my iPhone. I've been meaning to do this talk for the longest time now and I'm finally going to share it with you. Before I get into that, I just wanted to give a huge shout out to Awesomeness TV for launching their very own TV show on Nickelodeon. It's going to start uh, July 1st, I believe, on Monday and it's going to feature some of your favorite YouTubers. Definitely check it out. It's 7, 6 central and I actually have some of my friends in it like Jen Xpan, Leah Marie Johnson and I'm just so excited to see when YouTubers succeed like that and we're gonna have a like tweeting party so definitely join it watch it let people know what you think and uh, yeah I just I just had to mention it so today I'm gonna show you what's on my phone this is the iPhone 5 I really love the design of it which is why I haven't gotten a case for it yet I did have a screen protector which sort of got dirty so I took it off but yeah it's just the white iPhone and I have all my apps nicely organized and on the first page right here I have all of these apps that I personalized I sort of created these little scans using the Cocopa app it's like a it doesn't like you still have to keep keep your original apps which I stored right here in the stored apps folder so they're still all right here which sort of gives you like allows you to personalize and make your apps cute I think I've seen a video on it I'll link it down below if I find it on how to do that but yeah I just made like all my little scans um, I have like a cute Twitter like a rainbow a polka dot Facebook a uh, Galaxy Google thing and a bunch of cute little things. So basically on this first page, right here down below I have, oops, I have my phone, I have my email, I have my messages, and uh, my Instagram. The app that I use the most on my phone, hands down, is Instagram. It's my number one favorite app. If you're not following me yet, definitely do it. It's Evelina Berry, and I post a lot of really cute things like what I ate for breakfast and like my homemade meals well actually i try to focus on more on fashion like i post my accessories my home decor just sort of interesting things that happen to me during the day that i like to kind of do my artistic take on it on how i edit and take the picture so yeah that's that evelina berry on instagram if you're not following me yet and then of course i have twitter which i love so you see it takes me to the twitter app and um yeah this is me i tweet well i'm not like annoyingly tweeting like a hundred times a day but I still try to like keep people updated and like if videos aren't uploading or anything like Twitter is probably the best way to contact me and to reach I try to reply to pretty much everyone so yeah I use Twitter a lot so okay so this is the first page I have also Pandora Google Maps Skype 9gag which is a site that I absolutely love I'm um, like the app for it you go and you see whatever's new and exciting and amazing and funny on the internet so like any memes that come out so now to the exciting stuff Stuff. I will show you the apps that I use the most to edit my Instagram photos. So right here in photography, um, right here I have VSCO Cam. I have both of them, which is one of my favorite apps to use to take photos, edit the photos. I think it really has some... I just took this one, by the way. I'm going to post it on Instagram later. Um, so it has this really cool, more subdued, natural filters. Like I think Instagram filters are just way too much. They were really fun when they first came out, but now it's like, eh, I don't think I want a super blue look like I am tweeting under the ocean, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, it has like more subdued, like more like nice little filters like that. And then you can go and edit the contrast, the brightness, fill in shadows and things like that. So it sort of creates a very prof more professional look, which is what I'm going for. Um, then I have, I don't use the lighting effects anymore, but if you like that sort of a bokeh lighting, um, iDarkroom's really great, Lumi's really great, Pixel Aromatic, and PicFX, PicFX, Pic, whatever. Those are great if you like those sort of light effects and stuff. Uh, this one's my favorite, it's picture frame. It's like the easiest way to do a collage. It's like so much better than pick stitch, not even funny. No, I don't want to. It's like asking me for all these free things. But yeah, you can just add your pictures, um, adjust how big you want your frames. It's like the best, most simple, most efficient app out there. So next one is the games. I used to have a lot more, but I recently reset my phone, which caused me to lose a ton of footage and also a lot of my games. But I have some of my favorite ones. The one that I'm like absolutely obsessed with right now is Slain. Let me turn up some musics. So it's basically like this little guy. It's sort of like an 8-bit game and you like go and kill these little guys. It's like the best thing ever. It's so addicting. I'm like 
addicted to it, slain. Then I have another one that you might want to check it out is Jetpack. Is this like little guy, his name is Barry, which is so funny. He just goes around and like you have to make sure that he doesn't hit any lightsabers or anything like that. It's like one of my favorite apps too. Um, Angry Birds is too old. Uh, Tiny Wings is really fun. And then there's Ticket to Ride. If you've ever played the board game, Ticket to Ride is like so much fun. Uh, you can play with your friends, you can like pass around your phone. It's just like a really fun board game. And lastly, what I wanted to show you is my fashion folder where I keep all of my fashion apps that I enjoy to use. Vogue UK, Vogue Stylist, Style.com, and Style Tag. For example, I go on Style.com and I just see all of the fashion news and everything that's going on, the recent style videos, the parties, everything that's fun and exciting in the fashion world I have on my app. Um, then I have, of course, Vogue UK, which is my favorite Vogue. Of course, I love Vogue Russia, which my mom brought me from Moldova. My mom, by the way, is here for the summer. So awesome. So yeah, that's pretty much it on my phone. I forgot to put a cute background to show you guys. Um, this is the background on my... Um, front right now that's not very nice but I just really felt inspired when I saw that yeah don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and also subscribe if you're not subscribed to my second lifestyle channel yet and um, yeah make sure you keep up with me with all my social media like Twitter Facebook and all that stuff no Facebook I don't go on Facebook that much Twitter Twitter is the place that's it I love you bye